All right, here we are on the classwork for 1.2. Goal is to do the whole thing. So it really just says one and two, but one takes up a whole. So number one says a cran apple juice blend is mixed in a ratio of cups of cranberry to apple is three to five. Complete the table and show different amounts that are proportional. Okay, this is the hardest part always. always. Cranberry to apple. So the first number is the cranberry number. So three would go here, five would go here. People are always mixing it up. Okay, you gotta read. So then across the top, you know, then it'd be six, then it would be nine, and then after five, you no, know, it'd be 10, and then 15, okay? Part B, why are these quantities proportional? I'm not gonna do it for you, but my hint would be to compare constants. Don't know how to find the constant? Go back and look. All right, and then you're going to write the equation. Using the equation in Part D is so important, and E and F. If you are not using the equation to plug in an, a number, you're not doing it correctly. All right, and then on the second page, number two, John is filling a bathtub that is 18 inches deep. He notices that it takes two minutes to fill the tub with three inches of water. Two minutes, three inches. He estimates it will take 10 more minutes for the water to reach the top of the tub if it continues at the same rate, is he correct? So set up a table first. At least they tell you that. Some people try to not do that. And you're talking about minutes and water, okay? So do set up a table and start with that it takes him two minutes to get three inches, okay? So that's the only hint I'm gonna give you for that. And then I think you guys have it handled. So that's all I'll do for now. If you have more questions, you can always come to office hours or send me an email.